I'm Amy. I'm living in Chrysalis. And I'd like to see what I can do to enhance this fun fair look. <laughs> so let's get to it. Welcome or welcome back. Always happy to see you. Um, yeah, so today we, for the summer program I work for, we took the kids to this sort of fun fair thing. I, I wouldn't call it a carnival because there were no rides. Um, but there were some games, some activities, that sort of thing. So, got my face painted. Yep, so there we go. Unfortunately, I fell right asleep when I got home. I just conked right out in my chair. So, it got a little bit messed up. But, I think I, I'm going to touch it up. And then I would like to do a face to complement the look. So if that sounds like fun to you, make sure to stick around. And of course, if you haven't already, you know what to do. Like, subscribe, comment, share, all that good stuff. Oh, I was going to show you. One of the activities was making a rattle. So I made this. They had a... And all these different colors of tape and I'm unoriginal so <laughs> there we go I used the dried peas in it so that's what I've got and can I say I guess I'll be ready for pride next year so first I'm gonna go into Mar and just try to touch this up a little bit I think whoops I always do that I think gridlock may work let me give that a try is that too green? Well, maybe a little bit. I'll throw a little detour on it as well. See how that goes. So I think between gridlock and detour, I should be able to touch this up a bit. And I'm just, for instance, I'm just going into gridlock and then I'll go into detour and just kind of touch it up a bit. It's not face paint, but it'll work, I think. I'll throw up a bit, <clears throat> excuse me, I'll throw up a photo of what it looked like earlier. Okay, I think that's probably about as good as this is going to get. <laughs> oh, hey, on hand. Throw a little more detour there, I think. I kind of liked the idea of this sort of swooping wave. I did have glitter along, he along like there as well, but... You know, I, I rolled over. <laughs> so I'm just kind of, but I, but at least it's still held in place there. So I really like that. I'm not gonna... For the eyebrows, what I like to do is actually go into detour. So I'm going to that to make them nice and blue. I may need a stiffer brush. You see. Well, I think I can make that work. Not the most precise line ever, but I can clean it up with my finger. I think I'm doing alright there. Cool. I have to admit, I do wish I had the Blue Moon palette. I'll be getting it at some point, but this summer I'm freaking broke. And now that I've decided I don't want the ColourPop Uh Huh Honey or the Orange You Glad, 
I want the blue moon and I want the strawberry shake. So I'm waiting for, so even if I weren't broke, I would be waiting for one more so I don't have to pay shipping because I'm a cheapskate. Besides, most of the shades in Blue Moon wouldn't work with this anyway. This is really more of a blue-green palette. Oops. Yeah, we hit a little more gridlock right there. I'm going into my LA Girl Hot Hot Heat. And going into Plumeria, which is gorgeous. I'm going to go ahead and just use my finger here because the, I'll cover the other anyway. And, but I do want a nice thick layer down for the arch this time. Which isn't my usual technique, but neither are blue eyebrows, so let's roll with it. Oh, there we go. That's nice and thick. There we go. Island life. This appears to be a satin. And I'm going to really slap it out of there. Oh, that's pretty. I even like the way it's mixing with Plumeria. <laughs> yeah, so at this little fun fair, we had, uh, there were the activities, the little shaker, of course, face painting. There was a, a little obstacle course for the kids. Um, oh. We didn't even get to all this stuff, which I feel kind of bad about, but, you know, nothing I can do about it. There was also apparently a way to make a very crude bow, but the neatest thing was, and this is because it had a very heavy Native American theme, there was, um, there was this game where it was like a long pipe and the the top was cut out of it so you could see what was going on and then you would you would shove the stick like down this pipe and see how far it would go i they said the name of the game i don't remember it but but it was kind of neat oh and there were of course musical instruments for the kids to play with and Wow. That was cute. I'm going to go with a bit of Romance Smoke. As in, the shade is called Romance and I'm going to use it to smoke it in. I don't... Smoke out just is not accurate for me. So, I'm going to smoke it in. But yeah, oh, it was so cute too, because one, one of the little guys, you know, we're on a very noisy school bus g going to and from this thing, but on the way back, one little guy I was sitting next to, he, uh, he conked out right on me. It was so cute. <laughs> it was adorable. And this kid, he has, he's, he's small for his age, and he has the cutest little voice, like, oh, killing me. Oh, baby, no. You can be annoying, but, ugh, oh, a little voice just kills us all. Okay, let's see what, all right, I'm starting to feel okay about that. Of course, that's. The side size crisp is this side, but that's what concealer's for. I think I'm going to blend it out before I add anything. Just a little bit. I definitely wa want to remain fairly precise in my color placement. But 
But I like how that's fading up into there. I think that part turned out pretty fun. Except there's too much blue there. Hang on. Let me hit that plumeria again. Get it right there. I'm going to go back into Hot Hot Heat and go with, what's that called? Island Life. Right? No. Sorry. Maui. That's Maui. It does not look the same on the back. Like, see, it looks very dull on the back, but then when you look at it in here, it's this gorgeous shimmer shade. So throw some of that on, why don't we? And I'm just going to go all over the lid. Normally I'd get a little tipped off if it migrates down my face, but well, I, I don't really mind this time. <laughs> it's probably especially because I have the glitter there anyway. Oh, look! A piece of glitter just fell. Um, okay, maybe I do mind a bit of fallout. Okay, well, I'll have to touch that up. I'm still not in the habit of doing my eye makeup before my face. And I'm wondering if or when I'm going to actually change that. I should get into that habit, especially with these more detailed looks, I just forget, you know, it's 30 years of habit. Okay, ooh, well that's really starting to look nice there, look at that, cool. Mm. I'm feeling like I need a little something in here. I'm going to go a little out of the box. Maybe. Not really. I'm going to go with El Rey. It's the only non-blue shade. <laughs> but it does still have a bit of shimmer. It's like a sort of like a pale peach orangey peach shimmer. So that's a yeah, that's a fun touch. Okay. Oh, dang it. I gotta smooth out that line again. I know I should have just filmed straight when I got home, but I was just so exhausted. I needed to just sit down and then I just conked out because I was exhausted because um, running after numerous young children, especially that aren't your own, so you haven't been able to instill the fear of mom into them. Well, it's tiring. But it has its moments. I have a little hit of concealer. I think I need to make up a new mash. Okay, that's just <laughs> sort of blending out the blue more than covering it. Okay, that's kind of funny. Actually, that might not be the worst. Yeah, or maybe it is. Maybe I'm just delusional and... and it's just going to look like an awful mess, but that's okay. I'm just going to clean my face after this anyway, because... You know, I have to edit and go back to sleep. Ooh, it's ghosts. No, it's not ghosts, it's just my husband. <sighs> so, I was all excited because it looked like the like the belt for the washing machine arrived earlier than expected. It's the wrong one. 
awesome yeah <sighs> just didn't need that I'm gonna take detour and use it as a contour <laughs> <laughs> How far am I going to go with this? Far, very far. <sighs> Maybe I just want to do this wave theme because I really, really, really miss kayaking. I haven't been able to kayak since my car broke down. It's been weeks. Oh gosh, it's like three weeks now. Dang it. Just, just particularly upsetting for me. Hmm. Is the contour something I just should have not done? Probably. Am I taking it too far? Probably. Okay. What can I do for sort of a blushy sort of color? But still water blue. Is there something photo teat perhaps? I'm going to go with this purple, I think. What was that shade called? Orchid. Who doesn't like a nice orchid blush? Probably a lot of people. My one friend can't, can't even wear purple because it makes her look dead. I, on the other hand, adore purple. I look pretty awesome in it, actually, if I do say so myself. Okay. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have tried contouring with this, though. Mm -hmm. Oh, well. <sighs> Lessons learned. Is there anything else I can do here? Ooh. Okay, I'm going to try something new. I've got some Vaseline on my lips and I'm going to go back into Mar and see if I can use this as like a lip color. Since I don't own a blue lipstick. And I don't know. Maybe if I get more into costuming or cosplay, I might buy one, but it just doesn't make sense right now. Mm -hmm. Oh, here we go, concealer. Before I give up the ghost, I'm going to go into gridlock. I'm going to do the rest of the things and I'll be right back. I've done the things. So while I'm not trying to evoke anything in particular, I was sort of thinking this like a, a water goddess, perhaps. Apparently a very cold one since my lips are blue. Ooh. I want to go kayaking so bad. So, of course, please let me know what you think in the comments. And if you haven't already, subscribe. Please subscribe and I'll see you soon.